welcome to the first of a new series of Plant Manager's Journal Plant Tests. In the blue corner we have the Digger Crusher 700, an excavator mounted crusher bucket attachment sold through Seoul UK importer Worsley Plant. And appropriately in the red corner we have the UK manufactured Red Rhino 5020T crusher, a rubber track mounted mobile jaw crusher. We're extremely pleased to be invited here today um, with Plant Manager Journal to demonstrate our 5000 series compact crusher. Uh, as you can see we're in normal site conditions with uh, standard rubble um, containing the dirt, the clay, the metal and the wood looking to reclaim the aggregates back uh, for reuse. It's been a pretty typical site I suppose. Uh, we've had a lot of different materials here, a lot of wire and metal and uh, I suppose quite difficult materials, but I think the machines cope quite well. In our first test, we wanted to check the speed of deployment. In other words, the time it would take each machine to travel from the vehicle upon which they'd arrived to taking up position on a work site. In our second test, we wanted to see how long it would take each machine to process a single bucket load of material. Our final formal test was looking at the productivity of both machines. To do this, we ran them side by side, working for an hour non-stop. So where would PMJ spend its money? Ultimately, such a decision must be based upon the intended application. If we ran a plant hire company with a strong relationship with a major local contractor, the Red Rhino would get our vote. If, however, we ran a transfer station or a demolition company, we would already be beating a path to the door of Worsley Plant.